What's going on, guys? Welcome back to some more of the Legend of Zelda Mirror's Mask, the last part. We got the giant top, we did the majority of Stone Tower Temple. Now we're gonna flip the temple back upside down because there are a few stray fairies we have left to get. We have yet to get. Maybe I could have, uh. I'll see you guys in a second. Anyway, so now back in Stone Tower Temple, as you noticed, um. Our stray fairy counter is at 11. The rest of the stray fairies are in this area. They're, they're ones we generally missed throughout the portion of this, uh. They're ones we generally miss throughout the portion of uh, of going through the temple because we they're they evolve like flipping switches and all that. Actually, they're not even like this one easy. This is an easy one to get. Like uh, this is our twelfth stray fairy. Now, an interesting thing about this portion of a uh, stone tower temple, we actually have to go through the uh, normal process of doing this. Now we have the light arrows. Like, as soon as you get the light arrows, you can kind of just, you know... Yeah, don't have, to bother, don't have to bother with that. Now that's actually where the compass was, and interestingly enough, we never got it. So, uh, that might be why I had trouble finding some of the straight fairies. Or at least I had trouble finding one of them, but like, um... We never got the compass. I think we're gonna take a look to see if I remember correctly where they are. So, uh... On the first floor, there are two, and, uh, the basement floor, there's one. So, uh, yeah, um, and on the basement floor, if we remember correctly, we need our Zora mask, so, uh, so yeah, we're almost to the end of, uh, Stone Tower Temple, and it's actually gonna turn in the third day. So, yeah, we actually did have time to do this temple after all. I think it's, uh, I'm trying to look for my CRT monitor, it's, uh, yeah, it's in here. That actually takes care of the one down bottom, and now there's two left. Interestingly enough, I think I remember uh, exactly uh, where that other one was. So, um, so it's going to we're going to go back to the left because uh, I remember the uh, I remember it was in one of the uh, rooms where the. Uh, you need the Zora mask for. Actually, we don't need to do that. I'm an idiot. Sometimes I'm not thinking straight even with games I've played dozens of times. But like, uh... It's not like we don't have time to do this. It's not like this is the final seconds of the night of the final day. Like, we have plenty of time to do this. Is what I'm saying. And uh, we need the Zora mask because we need to. Uh, this is what I was thinking of. This is the night of the. It's also the dawn of the final day. I'll, I'll try to get a couple of things done on the uh, dawn of the final day. And I'll teach you another way to rupee grind aside from killing that bird in a uh, terminal field. Where's that? Uh, where's that? Uh, I am legit lost. I'll we'll see you guys in a second. This is what I was thinking of. You need the, uh, you, you actually do need to go back in this, in the traditional way. So I was right the first time, except my instincts tell me I was wrong. But either way, we get our 14th stray fairy, and I will actually cut to when we get the uh, 15th stray fairy, because at the very end of this section of the temple, So yeah, here's the room with the uh, stray fairy, and this is the last of the stray fairies, which, uh, interesting enough, we can now sort of the entrance. So uh, we will just sort of the entrance and uh, flip the temple back upside down. So I'll see you guys back when it's upside down. Alrighty, so now that we have all the stray fairies, now that we have the temple completely upside down, I think it's time to fight the boss, which, uh, we need the giant smash for. So, uh, the boss of this temple is the other reason I recommended getting Chateau Romani before coming here. Because you can do it without Chateau Romani, but it'll be much more tedious. Ooh. 
we'd have to go back to where that uh, room was. And uh, it's not really too long of a walk. We are almost done with Stone Tower Chapel. And I'm really excited that I actually uh, got this done. It only took a... It didn't even take like an hour of like in-game time. It took just about an hour to do this temple. So yeah, I would say this is definitely the longest of the temples. Now it's time to put the boss key in there. It's boss time. Diamond insect, wind mold. Try as you might, you cannot attack Twin Mold in our normal state. But they also do kind of show its weakness, so, um... The reason I recommend getting Shadow Armani, you can use the Giant's Mask, but it takes up magic. We have to kind of either hit Twin Mold's head or tail. Either or works. We either wait for its tail... It's like that boss in, uh, Mario Galaxy 2. Yeah, we're not taking a... We're taking a lot of damage, we're getting kind of corners. I got we have the defense. Just be careful, because if you go to some of the edges like that... I'll be right back. Yeah, if, uh, if you end up in the quicksand in the edge, it resets the fight. So just be wary of that. And unlike the other transformation cutscenes, this one's not skippable. It's only applicable to this fight, though. I'm not- I don't- I'm not sure if the hit counter resets, but I know it does- it does- you do have to go back and do this fight over. So just stay in the middle at all costs. It sh you should be fine as long as you have Chateau Romani. You just stay in the middle at all costs and kind of keep attacking them. And one of them's dead. Once you get one of them down, it's easy to get the other one down. <laughs> okay, let's get twin mold. Where are you, twin mold? Where are you, other twin mold? The other twin mold. I don't know what your. I don't know what these guys' actual names are. They're just called twin mold. I call these guys by their official names. I think my hit should do it. One hit did it! Yay! We are now done with Stone Tower Temple.
We're going to take off the giant's mask because I don't exactly remember where the heart piece is. It's right there. If I was car to get in a giant face. Anyway. Now it's time to play out the cutscene. We got twin mold remains. We've now have all the remains.